it is green for go here at the UCI Mountain Bike World Cup in Snowshoe. The under 23 women's cross country race is led off the line by Ronya Blurklinger. Burry's in there with her as well as is Samara Maxwell. Yeah, Ronya Blurklinger all the way strong and short track racing as well and also a good start here. Track just in the cross country. Just bottles, bottleneck slightly on the start loop, but it's Blurklinger in that red jersey. Then the world champion Sammy Maxwell behind her. Second place, he is in that first corner. Numi Garnier, the French national champion in fourth place. Not always the same. There is Sammy Maxwell out front then on that new rock rider bike, ahead of Ronja Blurklinger. Yes, yeah, Sophie Hebe Peterson now on ninth place, so she dropped back a little bit. Really cool, really, really good natural terrain. If you ride mountain bikes, you love to see this stuff in race courses. Oh. Yep. Curry just getting bobbled Put slightly. Out. That will allow Maxwell. She's fast, Sammy Maxwell. Wow, also foot out. Whoa! Oh, Sammy. Big swap on from Sammy Maxwell. And now just stuck in the tree and should be in the wrong gear. Has to get the seat adjusted again. That caused a lot of time, which. She hit the tree. She lost a lot of time there, Bart. It looks like the, the wheel just got stuck the wrong side of it and she couldn't get it right. And here we go, talk us through it. Yeah, she's dancing actually oh. over these rocks and roots and then suddenly her, her rear wheel slides away out of control. Yeah, it's one she's of, back on the wheel of Noel Burry. It's one of the uh, the quieter talents of these full suspension cross-country race bikes is that as Maxwell goes past Burry now, is that they really allow you to climb when traction's at uh, its lowest, don't they? You can just, it allows the back end of the bike to move up and over routes and keep that forward momentum going. Well, Burry, in third place, with the number four on her bike. Maxwell, uh, look at pulls Maxwell. Out and stands up and attacks Blurklinger now. She's feeling good. Blurklinger, though, looking like she's going with her. Yeah, I think when you're blocking her, that's still something left. You could see the expression on her face. She wasn't giving everything she has. These two getting a wriggle on now at the front. 19 seconds back to Bury. And it's a long season. Oh, oh, Sammy Maxwell. That's why they like to be in the first position. Just getting bobbled slightly yeah. there. Do you see? These roots, yeah, she lost all her momentum, all her speed. But look, right with her, right past her. Uh, because of what we saw before, that, that sprint they both had in the tech feed zone area. Yeah? And there is the overall series leader's jersey of Sophie Heavy Person, as I say, three and a half minutes back off the front. Yeah, with Tamara Wittmann in front of her. So she's got past her as well, so I think. I think that may well be 20 of spot at the minute for Sophie Heavy Patterson. Sometimes you don't know exactly how it comes or you don't feel it that it will happen, but is that more difficult if you is that more difficult than when you know it's an injury or you know it's Yeah, no, uh, no that yeah, then it's then, then it's a good reason for it. Yeah, uh, this Burry is the battle for Ferdinand. Very in Kaluri. Sophie Heavy Patterson five minutes back off the lead of this Ooh. race, nearly six minutes back off the front of this race. Around the 20th position. The Danish overall leader. But on these sections, the riders, they have to be more careful. You saw a foot out for oh. Noel Burry in between these trees. A very narrow section over there. Great the bike line from Kaluri there. Overtaking Absolutely her. superb from Junior Kaluri through there. So much faster. A foot out again for Noel Burry. Samara Maxwell, the class of the field and out onto the final lap then for the New Zealander. Out of the saddle, 40 seconds between the numbers one and two in the race. But she's looking like a spent force here, Bart, compared to the rider out in front of her. Yeah, but this is very steep where she is, uh, so it's a yeah, different part of the course. 40 seconds now, the gap between first and second. There's your leader, the UCI world champion, Samara Maxwell. What a tour de force this has been. A minute, three seconds now. The clocks show in the booth. The work is done. The work is nearly done. Samara Maxwell, what a debut on the Rock Rider 14. 
for Samara Maxwell, the UCI world champion is going to check out and take victory. Are we going to see the dance moves? There they are. Samara Maxwell celebrates in her own style right here in Snowshoe, West Virginia. She takes the win by a huge margin. And the seventh round of the UCI Mountain Bike World Cup, Snowshoe, West Virginia. That is how you do it. Sammy Maxwell takes the win in front of the American crowd. Ronnie Blertlinger undefeated in cross country short track in 2023. Second place today for Blertlinger in snowshoe. Another successful weekend at the office for Ronja Blertlinger. Noel Burry, she managed to break free. And really, it was that technical descending and the power at the top of the climbs that did it for her. Kaluri comes in third. Looking like she enjoyed that one. Yeah, happy with the third place. Here is the top ten then. Maxwell, Blurtlinger, Kaluri, Burry, Johnson, Srenska, Waite, Van Til, Monroe and Boom. Six minutes 41 covering the top ten. Gives you an idea the pace Sammy Maxwell was travelling at. One minute, two. Back to second place, Ronja Blurtlinger. Maxwell finishing on a different minute to everyone else. Good ride that from Emily Johnson. Another good ride, I should say. Srenska as well from the Czech Republic. Solid end of the year for her. As we head to Canada next weekend. Can she break into the top five there? Here is Sophie Heavy Peterson cutting a rather dishevelled figure. 12 minutes 10 behind the race winner, Samara Maxwell. That overall points leader's jersey. So here are the all important overall standings. And Ronja Blertlinger takes the overall points jersey into the final round in Mont St. Anne from Sophie Heavy Peterson, who is herself now well within the grasp of Samara Maxwell, today's winner. Burry's in fourth. Then it's Kaluri, Garnier, Van Til, Monroe, Johnson, and Cordonovis.